Although not necessarily meaning that go because we're on hero now. Making a strong case for maybe the best hero. Maybe not in terms of placement, but in terms of technical skill. They know their stuff, right? Yeah, definitely. Gives me uh, Mystery Soul vibes in the way they play as well, where they just have these reads that it's just like, where did you get that? <laughs> like, this hasn't happened yet. Yeah, you know? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. like, I get it when people read me after I've done something, but these two will just read me. Out of nowhere. Yeah. It's and different. it's bad when it's hero. I'll t <laughs> Boom. You got crit and died at 20. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Definitely poor. But <laughs> regardless, we got Lumeco Sparkle. Bayo coming out officially. Definitely the character I do see Lumeco's play the most. Right. You know, Rosa is like a secondary, I believe. But I mean, they're they're pretty proficient at it. Nice catching. That was crazy. He did the two jabs to check the DI and still got the follow-up with the ABK afterwards when he when Sparkle missed the tech on the ledge. But damn, up smash read out of nowhere. Killing yeah, that was so early. So good from Lumecos. They have to be feeling that one after that. Right. Kaboom! In neutral. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I mean, Sparkle said it himself. It's just, oh no, no way. Surely not. Okay. <laughs> Bayo's recovery is amazing. Anyway, Sparkle says to himself, Kaboom and neutral. I mean, it's it's stereotypical. Kaboom, lol, hero, amazing. Can't react. But Kaboom and neutral is not good. <laughs> it's, well, it just it's, costs a lot of mana. Yeah, it, that's the thing. It costs infinite mana, and it, like, doesn't, like, do anything. Well, like, does, from full screen. Like, if you're not getting hit by it, which you shouldn't because you have the entire time. Anyways, about those reads we're talking about. Like, Back hit down smash. It's 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 set, okay. It's set one or a game one, and he already does something like that. It's like it can be either a weed or just the willingness to go for something like that. And Sparkle just showing that he can. Yeah. Um, but sixty-eight percent. I always like to comment to hero in like two waves. Where <gasps> that was such a good reaction. Did they get the kill off this? No, sure. not coming for the up B. But yeah, Hero has like two phases where they're going for their spells for their neutral, their neutral game, or they're trying to scrap and get it back, right? And yeah. in this case, as you get like the past the first 20 seconds of that game plan, you start having to fight them, yep. and that's what makes a Hero player good. Yep. And yep. Sparkles is good. He actually double buff. Double buffs. Yeah, we we got Oomph and Psych up on deck. Lumecos. Oh no! Boom. Yep. Can't shield. Back air when it's double buffed and down air and dash attack and F smash. Um, <laughs> wow! Oh, I'm not getting the kill. That was such a good witch time too on the uh, whoosh there. But Sparkle's definitely going to be taking this lead. Going to be F smashing that F smash from Lumeco. So usually the guns help like stall people from hitting you. But here has a sword down air. Hero didn't care. Yeah, but hero didn't suddenly care. even. Comparatively to where we were before. Like, Wait. look, 100 Kaboom once you're at 64 mana. Like, that's hard it's good to and bad. consistently I mean, that's, do that's and have it be decent. You'd rather just use Neutral that yeah, Going for that air dodge read. You're going to eat something for it. We got a, got a Bayo combo coming in. Slide Quick 40. Slide off ABK, but wow. Ball. Super good read. Realizing most people, you know, will jump after the whoosh because of its weird knockback properties. Mm -hmm. For sure. Ooh, dude. One buff, you're at... Yep. Yep. Right awareness. Right up, up tilt after uh, a failed ABK that didn't really like... Hero? Out. Dude, Hero's faster than people think. Yeah. He, can, he can cover ground. He'll get there. I mean, it's like the characteristics are more overshadowing his spells, his crates, the RNG factor. But then people, like, look at the vanilla character. They kind of forget. Some of the boxing tools are really good. Like, yeah. we see Fair and Nair a lot. And it's really scary when uh, Hero had the full charge. We saw it earlier, right? Lumekos. <laughs> they would have died. They would have died. Like super dead. Super duper dead. <laughs> so, you know. Yeah. Just that awareness. Great boxing tools by Sparkle. Really solid game one by him, I think. Um, Mechos, I wonder if they end up going with the character switch. I know you said they had a Rosa. It's I, not can't like ima I can't imagine Rosa Hero being good. It sounds Possibly like Luma better. will just get tossed around. <laughs> it, it, it literally sounds like Icy's Hero, mm -hmm. which is apparently Terrible. not winnable. Um... <laughs> Has Sparkle and Big D ever played? I don't think so. I want to see that. Big D did play that one hero player from SoCal. Was that impossible? I'll show you the clip after. Okay. <laughs> chat, chat knows, though. Shoutouts to DC. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, that sounds that sounds. <laughs> oh, that clip is so funny. Anyways, Running going back, back to PS2. PS2. Yeah, I mean, take a shot every time PS2 is the the stage Ooh, selected. That was a nice read. It didn't lead to too much, but usually after. I mean, that was supposed to be a combo. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so well, we'll we'll take it, but definitely could have gotten way more off of that. But <laughs> Accelerado and I didn't see if it was Oom for Psycho, but we got one of them. Got one of them and 20 mana. Dude, a classic Bayo thing to do is Bayo's will tomahawk so much, but because they're a fast hauler, they'll tomahawk with their tilts usually. Because like up tilt, people just like will see Bayo like jumping there and like, oh! yeah, no, that's the classic. You're charging, and they're like, do you want to punish this man? Do you want to punish this buddy? And then they decide whether or not they want to in that moment, and then you react to if they did anything and let go. <laughs> usually, usually. Of a character like Bowser, even that F smash probably wouldn't kill such a stage. I mean, it was, it was it was fully charged and whatnot, and it had was it Oom Psych up? Doesn't really matter. I mean, both of them make it extra scary. Nice tomahawk grab from Dude. Sparkle, and that's the willingness to go for the reads, like we were saying. And yeah, I mean, just paying off in spades here. Right. Wow, going for these F smashes, going for these witch times. Sparkle just waiting. That's heal. We're below 100. Below That's 100. important. Wow, yeah. Dude, that bang Day is active frame. for, like, <laughs> double-digit frames. Like, it's it's there, like, similarly to Kaboom, where it feels like forever. Wow, Sparkle looked like he had that read, but Lameko's doing it, like, a bit late, so it was a bit awkward. I mean, even even if <laughs> you're Lumekos in that situation where you have all that advantage, going against Psych Up and just run up up tilt, who cares? Yep. Uh, covers both jump, covers you trying to swing. And uh, one of the things that Bayonetta's love to do is short hop into instant ABK. So, you know, catches that for sure, especially in the scramble situation. Going for the up throw, no true combos off of that. But 25% yeah. from the charge side, excuse me for not knowing the name. Uh, Ooh. Up up wow, yeah, ah. Sparkle just keeps, like, realizing the positions where Bayos will, like, They'll be landing with lag, but they'll like try to do some funny gimmick, and he'll read the thing after oh, every time. Killed. Wow, that killed! Holy <laughs> shit! Good stuff. Yeah, way high up there. You know, PS2 smaller blast zone. You have more experience with Bayonetta than me. Is that your fault if you die to that, or is it on the Bayo? To do that? <sighs> I'm not that guy. You are not. I, that I guy. SDI. I don't know. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm always curious, right? Like. Obviously, Lumeco is good enough where they can get it. Depends. It, sure, the sure, short sure. answer is it depends. Like, way up there, Sparkle might have just been doomed, right? But mm -hmm. if, if we're from, like, down here, you could have just STI down, right? Right, right, right. Ooh, ooh, yeah, reading a spot dodge. That might be the... <laughs> Sparkle getting the best case scenario when you're low on mana. Get Accelerado plus another buff and just run at them. Yeah, you just run at them and people... It's funny because it's like C4. People will just like hard aggro onto you, and then you can just like wait and react to anything they do. Lumekos is landing so many of these grabs. So yeah, good. Tomahawk grab looking real good, but doesn't get the wow. roll read. Yeah, not not reacting to the tech option. Kaboom! Not able to jump away. <laughs> it was like he a black got, hole. He was full hopping and he couldn't leave. Yeah, they, they were not getting away from that. <laughs> That was like the black hole item. It looked like they were <laughs> stuck in there. Oh my I mean, it sure felt like that way. I mean, a full hop and you still can't get away from a projectile. That's a messed up projectile. Yeah, when, when Kaboom's like suck, you just have to be shielding on the ground. Otherwise, you can't. Yeah, I don't even think you can air dodge. I mean, maybe if Lumeco's... You can, but it's that active. It'll yeah. catch the air dodge. It's yeah, crazy. Sure. Like, you needed to take some of the, the, the suction hitbox and then, you know, air dodge the, the actual explosion. But Lumeco's... Lumeco's not playing bad at all. I mean, these games have been close, right? So Ooh, great punish. Great. That's a... That usually, you can't really mess with that if you're that far away from uh, Heroes Up B. But Bayo so has that, you know, aerial burst option that, like, yeah. what, like two characters have? Like, Ike, <laughs> I guess. Yeah. Maybe, maybe it's like the, the drop kick from, from Me Brawler. Yeah. That's what it reminds me of anyways. But yeah. Oh my gosh, getting sucked in again. Okay, Jump there you go. We're talking about it. Best case scenario. You're out of mana, but you got Accelerado, so you can actually fight. Going for wow. that down smash. 110%. Not killing, sending to the other side of the stage. Ooh, Lumeco's doing a little bit of panicking in these options, I feel like. Yeah, but still able to get that up. He got a shield on the fair, which mm -hmm. very good, right? You know, you always want to get those punishes that you can get Heroes fair being. Oh, wow. my God. Up tilt is just the MVP for Sparkle right now. Yeah, I mean, if you're in that mid range, what's Bayo going to do other than ABK in instantly? 
Right, tries to go for the Gimp, but still has mana. Full charge up B. Oh gosh. Ooh, I like that a lot. <laughs> Wouldn't have killed that early, but... Okay, okay. what's our combo? Something. I wonder if maybe forward air would have worked a little bit better, but the footstool oh, gonna take it. Oh yeah, the jump, it's gone! Oh. I think they were, yep. Yeah, classic. You cannot punish Bayo after F smashing on respawn immediately. She will still have uh It's a very funny bait. <laughs> I did not know that existed. Yeah, so Bayos will just F smash twice. It's <laughs> seeing from Lumekos right there. Usually characters can't punish this 15 degree angle that Bayonetta comes at. But I feel like Hero has really good tools. I mean, we're seeing it a lot. Uh, where Lumekos can't really get in in terms of just like the raw options. Ooh, nice wow. switching up the timing. I like Are that a lot, and oh my god, Witch Time barely being active enough. Up tilt, switching to this other Dude. side, up smash, not killing, was fully charged. They, they even waited for the Witch Time to end, which reduces knockback, and it still wasn't enough. Yeah, Hero just being unexpectedly heavy. Not enough rage, but usually up smash, especially assisted by the PS2 platform, oh. like that was elevated, right? But yeah. not exactly enough, and that's not what you want to see if you're Lumet Coast. Running out of mana, but you do have a buff. You got Accelerata. Coming up, nine mana, just going for the run up up tilt so fast, but doesn't find it. Let's see if Sparkle just presses up tilt. Lumeko's being a little bit more aware, a little bit more keen. Yeah, I've wait, gotten hit by wait. this up tilt so many times. Not getting hit by the kaboom either. <laughs> All right. Lumeko. This is where legends are made. <laughs> Zero percent to 113. Can Lumeko's make this comeback? Yeah, you're, you're on your no last jump. game too. Fine, nice snap. Combo. Forward air. Coming ABK. in. ABK. Great DI by Sparkle. Yeah, they just held in. Doesn't necessarily find it. Zero mana, so have to go for the boxing option. But it doesn't matter. I mean, right now we've realized that Sparkle's 